I want to apologize in advance for my awful camera work. But what can I say? I'm a critic, not a cameraman. Everyone and welcome to another Lazy Indian rant. So, I watched the other day a Christmas story. Ah, uh, yes, I, I, I had only seen that movie once, but I knew it was a classic, and I remember always loving, loving at the time I watched it. So I watched it again, and you know, as I was watching it. And then enjoying it, and, and just overall getting the scope of this child and his memory of it, his favorite Christmas. I can't help but realize Christmas movies today are done completely wrong. I mean, think about it. What are Christmas movies nowadays? Well, usually they're kind of like. Lots of them are just rip-offs or continuations of the same old thing. If the Santa Claus gets another movie, I will kill myself. No, I'll just kill all of them. But someone's gonna die. Um, you know, like, movies like, I don't know, there's one called Deck the Halls where two neighbors were duking out to see who can get the best house with all the Christmas lights. And the only other one I remember is something called Four Christmases with Vince Vaughn and... He and his, he and his, uh, and he and his wife have to go to a Christmas with four of their family because both of their parents are divorced, so and remarried. So they go to four different Christmases. Well, whoop dee doo. Christmas movies. I don't even think. Like, sure, you can do some Christmas movies about Santa, and you can do. Some about the birth of Christ, which you definitely need to do. Some about the birth of Christ, because that's what Christmas is all about. But you can only do so many until, you know, you're just doing the same thing over and over again. Christmas movies should be about memories. Just like a Christmas I don't think people should rip off a Christmas story and make their movies just like a Christmas story. But think about it, guys. Every one of you out there have a different Christmas memory. Everyone has one. I mean, if you think about it, everyone has different memories and stuff that made them, you know, love Christmas. Like, oh, I remember when blah dee da Or, I remember this. Oh, we all have good memories and bad memories. And But besides them being good or, or bad, there are still memories. And that's what I think Christmas movies should be about. The time that we had. The experiences. What we believe then, what we believe now. How how it changes us, how it influences us, and why. You know, why does the simple act of giving presents mean so much? I, you know, it's it's very... I just think that that's what Christmas movies should be about. They shouldn't be about, like, the last... I remember I saw a movie called, a trailer for a movie, didn't see the movie, called Unaccompanied Minors, which I could tell was a Home Alone ripoff. Eh. While we were here, I'll show you my fort I made when I was a kid. Anyway, back to the topic at hand. You know, it was a slapstick... Sort of comedy about kids and adults chasing them. Now, Home Alone, if you look at that movie, it is really about a child experiencing Christmas, and, and it's about, you know, him trying to think for himself and be able to take care of himself and be able to love his family, even though, you know, they, they still they sometimes annoy him to death. Um... Because if you watch my uh, Christmas Classics review, which I hope to have another one out before Christmas, Christmas is over, but you know, I, I don't know. It depends if I can get them uploaded. Might be after Christmas, who knows. Uh, anyway, 
Uh, what was I going to say? Right, um, if you look at my Christmas classic review, I say that all Christmas movies nowadays suck. And they do! I mean, if you really look at them, nobody's coming out with that many Christmas stuff. And if they do, they're all about Santa. I hate Santa. Okay, listen, I never grew up believing that Santa was, you know, the guy gave me presents. My parents never taught me that. And I'm never going to tell my kids that. And it's not just because I am a Christian and Santa is, you know, it's everything bad about Christmas. That's not what, don't think that because a lot of Christians do tell kids about Santa. Because I don't want to because I am essentially lying to them. I am like, I would be essentially saying, well, there's this guy that comes out of the sky and he gets, goes down chimneys and he gets presents. Bull! I mean, you're essentially lying to them. I know you're thinking, well, their minds are innocent and scripture has them something to believe in. True, but you don't need to give them absolute garbage. I mean, the simple story of Christmas is, is good enough. But, anyway, I'm not really here to, to talk about... I'm just saying, Santa movies are not interesting. I mean, here's Santa movies that I like. Miracle on 34th Street, old one, not the new. Or, one. Uh, the Santa Claus, only the first one. That's it! Like, I, like, the movies that are about... Those are the kind of movies that are about Santa, not movies that have Santa in them. For movies that are about Santa, that's all. And, you know, that's kind of sad. Now, let me just... Uh, I just think Christmas movies should have more thought put into them. Because why should Christmas movies cost, uh, just have less heart put in them than a normal movie. Maybe it's just the good movie, the good directors don't want to direct Christmas movies. I don't know. But I'm hoping that we get something good soon. Or else, I'm just going to say bah humbug. So Merry Christmas. And a Happy New Year. From Lazy 99. Merry Christmas. Be sure to check out more of my other videos on my channel. And wait for more coming soon.